hello 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 uh it's been a while as always um it looks like my stream up speed is actually doing okay today so i figured why not stream this new game that came out uh late last night early this morning kina bridge of spirits like i actually i bought it last night because i had a couple of gift cards and i was like oh yeah that kind of looks kind of fun and then i got it um and then i was like Oh, I thought this was releasing like tomorrow, like or tonight, but it actually released early, early this morning. So I got the times mixed up anyway, doesn't matter. So I kind of like watched it for a moment, like watched the beginning piece. And I was like, OK, I got to go back because it's late. Anywho, so here we go. So it's kind of still release day pretty much. So let's play a little bit. We're just going to play on normal mode or whatever. Not going to worry about that. Get into it. Unique wooden masks are carved to honor the dead, placed in sacred shrines. These masks gradually return to dust, symbolizing the spirit's peaceful journey into the next life. Not all spirits can travel this path alone, struggling with tragedies of their past. They linger and become dangerous. Masters call upon to help these trapped and violent manifestations known as spirit guides. Hey, Christian, how you doing? Hello, Chris. Uh, I'm doing all right. And that reminds me I need to pop out my chat. Okay, here we go. So, hey, yeah, I'm I'm doing I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. Like I said, just um, I was saying like right starting off, like just my upstream has been difficult, so it's kind of like really not um, kind of a pain trying to stream uh with like quality and stuff. So I've been doing a lot of recording, um, but. Um, the fruits of that haven't happened because it also takes me a really long time to upload anything I record. Uh, hello, weird spirit person. I guess we're going to follow this person here. Maybe. Anyway. So I've been uh, crashing through playing uh, Ghost, uh, the director's cut of Ghost of Shishima. And so I've been doing a bunch of recording at 4K and uploading like small videos for that guessing that's what I was supposed to do that looks like I was supposed to do um, but again it just takes uh, it takes a long time to upload even like a, a seven minute video which is kind of a pain also with work and stuff too I'm supposed to do anything with this I am I, that seems like I was supposed to do that maybe I don't know I have no idea what I was supposed to do anyway no I saw your video like well I mentioned it on your on your YouTube like you man you're getting some good views that's pretty cool yeah it is yeah it is the ps like the ps4 or the ps4 pro is fantastic but like it's amazing the um the quality of the ps5 like it just takes everything to the next level okay do i do this do i do that i don't know what i'm supposed to do where's the guide to help me know what to do Okay. Those are pulsing. Anyway. So. Okay, so there's one up there. But if I step off, it doesn't seem like I can. I really have no idea what I'm doing. Come on! Okay, so if I stand here, I release a pulse, and they light up. I guess I just need to stand in place. Well, that was pretty foolish on my part. Okay. Yeah, I love it. Um, but yeah, Ghost, we're playing Ghost. I'm trying to decide if I want to do FedEx game again when it comes out next month. Um, Death Stranding. Director's release. Director's cut. Yeah, dude. Yeah, it is. Wolverine, next Spider-Man. Gosh, beautiful. Um... What else? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, in February. 
power. Uh, so we get to fight now. Cool. LR1, light attack, R2 heavy. Okay, not bad, not bad. Okay. Um, yeah, oh, Ragnarok. Dude, Ragnarok. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait to see what they do with that. This looks like it's got pretty normal gameplay. You circle to da dodge, R1, R2 to attack. Pretty simple. Okay. Wonder if you, wonder if you get any like uh, counter attack stuff. Okay, you got charged attacks. Yeah, they're all gonna be fantastic. Absolutely. So I lit that thing up. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. Some people were complaining about Fat Thor, but that's more. Um, <laughs> that's kind of the war from Old Norse mythology is exactly what he should look like. So that's good. And it'll be cool. And release. Okay, got it. No, it's super exciting. Of course, these runes here now make me think of God of War. I really need to play it again. It's been too long. I haven't played it even... I haven't played it since probably not last summer, but the summer before. Oh, uh, man. Be fun. Anyway. The wolves right here. These these this reminds me of Ghost. Oh so good. I go this way? Nope. Interact. I saw him here somewhere. Yeah, like, buff Thor isn't normal Thor. <laughs> Marvel Thor. People just don't know. Be curious how uh not only with the thor thing but like here the god of war for their area like what's that gonna be like like are we gonna end up moving into like taking down the pantheon and then moving into like a whole new world in the next uh god of war or are they gonna just go mia forever like they did uh, after God of War 3. I hope not. Well, that's cool. Okay, so I learned how to collect that. Oh, absolutely. Greek mythology, North mythology, they're all really neat. There's a, I have a book uh, called Bullfinch's Mythology and it has a lot, like, the dude just like goes through and tells the stories and stuff. It's really good. It's super thick, but it's really good. It's a, uh, Learned about Yggdrasil and Odin and Slipnir and all those different things. But yeah, since they did the old God of Wars is in Greek, and now I guess some speculated that it would be um, Egyptian next, 
but who knows. Oh, double jump makes me happy. Well, jump should always be near the beginning of every game that involves jumping. That's the one down thing. So, one thing I didn't like about um, Jedi Fallen Order is uh, you got double jump late in the game, and it's like, oh, but I want to double jump all the time. It's more fun. Looks like this is something funky here. Oh, we get to collect another spirit. Cool. Yeah. Yes. I found a rot. Okay, cool. I don't really know what rots are yet, but we'll figure it out. That's a fat one. That one chuggy one should have counted for two. See that? Okay. It does. Fallen Order does now have new game plus. I'm pretty sure. Um because I got it on the PS5 on the, the PS5 release. And, um, ooh, this is creepy looking here. Okay, so you gotta collect rot to clear dead zones. Okay. Um, but you don't, I don't think you get the abilities like you do in, um, like in God of War where you get the, you get the cool, um, chains of chaos or whatever they're called, blades of chaos. See, treasure. What is this? Oh, it's just another rot. Alrighty then. Um, but yeah, you don't you don't get to I don't think you get to start with double jump and stuff, so that kind of sucks. Yeah. No, it was good to play through it again, and I, I mean I like my platinums, and it's not a hard platinum, not too long anyway either. Pretty enjoyable. I need to get some DLCs to go with it though. Or some just something a little extra. Go here. Actually. So I'm sure. Lights up, lights up, turns on the little crystal thing. Okay. Yeah, but yeah, totally fun, of course. I enjoyed hitting it up again. What about DLCs? I never did do, like, Assassin's Creed Origins or Odyssey's DLCs, and I really need to either watch videos on those just to catch up on the extra story stuff I missed. I don't know. No, that's the part that stinks, man. Yeah. Gamefly is disc only, um, unfortunately. Uh, they used to, Gamefly used to have kind of like a Steam game server type thing, but it didn't last very long. It was only out for uh, a couple, two or three years. Had a couple games on it, but no, it's a uh, physical disc only, which kind of stinks if you only have digital. Then there you are. I had missed that one. Interact with the rot. Knees. Bant. Rot can now perform more actions. Your team commands have grown and now you have one rot action available. Press square to send the rot onto objects in the environment. Collect rot. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. So I've got rot. Yeah. No, sorry, man. I mean, it's still good for like your PS4 and stuff, but yeah, not your, not your PS5. I'm going to use my rot. 
press pulse to destroy which purified that and opened a path all right cool hey i haven't had any drop frames yet that is a mere miracle i'm gonna get new internet soon they've been working on our fiber optic uh, cables and so I'll be able to buy some new, uh, or we'll be able to get some better up speed. Super excited for it. Of course, it's still nowhere near you can get what you can get in like a city or whatever. But hey, whatever works. All right. Am I going to be able to do anything with this one? Uh, rats are scared. Going to high attack enemies to build courage. Okay. So I got beat up baddies. Once they are down, then I can do the stuff. You can destroy. It's been hard to bind enemies. Press square to quickly send your rod into objects in the environment. Press L2 to aim. Okay. Cool. Okay. So I can bind these guys. That's neat. So bind that one while backing the others. I guess they have to recharge because it's not letting me do it now. Ooh. I don't know what that. Okay, cool. All right. Yep. See you after a while. that's supposed to be but cool all right I can now take care of that finish these guys off sweet oh there's another one up there seems like this kind of neat little game can use rot there but I kind of want to always like to explore just in case you know yeah. I can move certain objects in the environment press square to move the rot uh, have a rot pick up an object tell the rot where to go by aiming the L2 okay so you don't have to physically move you can use the rot oh what in the world Pick these up. Well, oh, they pick them up and eat them. Okay, I wonder if that what that does. No idea. Oh, I can tell it where to go, where to put it. Okay. Move object there. Ooh. That's cool. Thanks, little dudes. Release object, come back to me. Open. I don't know what the gems are for, but I guess we'll figure that out. No indicator on which way I should go. Just explore and no seed do. Wonder if I'm supposed to take that somewhere, or that just gives me good, uh, good mojo. Maybe <laughs> not that. Not whatever. I'm sure it gave me something. I don't know what it gave me, but it gave me something. Here, down there, 
weird secret area. Can you move that for me? That just give me a place I can climb back up. Nope, it does not. I'm going to bounce my ram way back around. It's got semi ups, not full ups. Survey, take a look. Don't know what the point of that was, but okay. And here's some more nasty dead zone stuff and some dude let me help you i can heal these spirits and restore balance to the forest i know you're kind <coughs> pardon me you sense the power that flows through this land but you do not fully understand it Thanks, Christian. Hope you have a good day at work, man. Always good chatting with you. Ooh, hello there. Route, huh? Press L1 to hold a shield, and then I bet it breaks after so many hits. Oh, okay. Now, can I do, can I have it? It can't hold. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Shield. Ooh. All right, use rot. That wasn't that bad. And I clear this. Sweet. I can see that. You both look very strong. Do you know who that spirit was with the horned mask? We don't know, but when he shows up, the girl's poison grows stronger. Hey, what are you doing here in the forest? I'm searching for the sacred mountain shrine. Can you take me there? If you want to get to the mountain shrine, you have to help us with something first. Our brother Tar was trapped deep in the forest. We need you to help him. Great idea, Saya. That'll be easy for her. Did you see what she did to that stick guy? Help us free Tar, and we'll take you to the mountain shrine. Woohoo! 
Come on, our village is this way. Sweet. Three more rot. We have a map. We have upgrades too. Okay. While sprinting, press R1 to perform quick sweeping actions. <laughs> you have to get higher rot levels to unlock those, I guess. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's a town. Aikyo. Discover a village or the village. Well, the village has got some issues, don't it? Guess that's the next place we have to free up. Jump up here. We can. No point in going there, though. Right. Oh, okay. Those aren't good. That one's shielded. So probably going to have to clear out those, which then unlocks that one and cleans that one out. I mean, it's a video game. It's pretty redundant how these things are. Clear this one. Good. One. Yep. Not quite unlocked yet. That is locked by a weird face. Locked by a face. Is there another flower thingy. Come back this way. Or am I just oblivious and just completely just missed wherever it's at? I'm gonna go oblivious. Oh, there's something up there though. Don't think that's it though. We'll get back to that. There it is. At least thought there'd be some enemies coming out of it. At least some more enemies. Hat cart discovered. We discovered Okay. We had karma by defeating corrupt enemies, restoring the environment, and finding fruit for your rot to eat. In the upgrade menu, you use karma to unlock new abilities. Kina can improve her base skills and infuse her abilities for rots for powerful attacks. Okay. So, makes 100 karma to do this one. 
Enter the fray. Requires rot level two, which I need seven more. Okay, so this one costs 50 parma. One costs 150 parma. What's this one do again? Hold R2 and press square to create a rot hammer that can create strike from any distance. Interesting. Okay. Got a clover thing. Clover hat. Okay. First chest, defeat all enemies. Oh, cool. Okay. Which more enemies we defeat, the more um, armor we get, I think. Or if there's any combo moves. They can charge an attack. Okay. Give me loots. Well, they just ate that thing. Well, that increased their karma. Uh, yeah, I got more karma. I don't know what the shards are for yet. Get that. Okay. Let's keep on looting. Arn tootin', keep on looting. The spring that runs beneath the forge carries with it energy from the mountain shrine. I guess I should go the hat card because that's what it opened up. Warp. Okay, what's a warp? So I'm gonna probably fast travel, of course, but I have not. Tar, so that's the uh, quest update, and it shows there are seven rots, four hats, and two flower shrines. Back here shows eight rots, which we've already got. In the village, there are lots of hats, lots of rots, eight flower shines, three spirit males, and six first chests. Okay, cool. I don't know what the locks mean. Maybe that just means I can't proceed yet. Where did he go? To set the challenge of the god tree, one must reach the top of its branch. Yeah. Uh, nope. Oh, so here's another blocked path. Running low on supplies. I hope we have enough in the storehouse. I'll need to go make sure. So obviously each area is blocked. You're going to have to go to one area, finish it. Another area opens up more than likely. Yada, yada, yada. The normal stuff. Back here where I've already been. Except now we can go up here. Can't do anything with that either, can I? Do we do? Huh? 
let me sneak in this little secrety way. Oh. Map. Let's talk to these kiddos. Is Tara this way? The barrier is blocking the path. Maybe Zadru can help. He's usually at the masked shrine. You'll know when you see the sacred trees. Masked shrine. Turn right. Hello, treasure chest that I apparently did not notice. And random hat. Well, this is the sh the hat shop. So there are lots of things I can buy, but I have no idea. I mean, it's, I'm guessing it's just they're just hats, which means nothing to me unless they get special abilities. Ooh, jumping into that would be bad. That's cool. Uh, to take a picture. seem quite fond of you. They're usually timid. <laughs> Something tells me you did not come to our village looking for forest creatures. Hello, spirit. I seek passage to the sacred mountain shrine. Our village is bound to the shrine's energy. But that power faded long ago. Trapped spirits linger here, tangled in the tragedies of our past. You must help these spirits if you wish to reach the mountain shrine. On my way, I met two children. They asked me to help free a boy named Taro. I'm not surprised that Benny and Saya found you. They are clever children and would do anything for their brother. We have always crafted wooden masks to honor those who have passed on. Placed here, the masks slowly turn to dust, aiding the spirit's journey into the next life. My father was a spirit guide. Our traditions are different, but he helped many spirits pass from this life to the next. So you know what happens to spirits unable to move on. Take Taro's mask. It is bound to his spirit and will help you fulfill your promise to the children. Look after Benny and Saya. Their brother's fate will be difficult for them to understand. Oh. Oh. Okay. Look to the mass to find your way. Open spirit bears to real objects of importance in the environment. Spirit masks are helpful to finding rot hidden in the world. Which means that Taro is possibly a messed on. Purple. I'm gonna guess that. Stay locked until later. Let's see how far we can go. I'm assuming this is going to hurt. 
Nope, just blocked. Go back to the kiddos. you give it to you? Maybe you can use it to open this barrier. Guess I wasn't close enough. has to come to play in some way. Look how shiny it is. Are you? You found spirit mail. You found something that belonged to a villager. Return it to their house in the village. The location is marked on your map. Okay. stick it in this thing. <laughs> Oops. The spirit mail unlocks the houses. Here are some weird looking things, which means it's a fight. <laughs> Free to house and a spirit. Okay. Boom. Now that his house is okay, his spirit can be set free. Ready then. Ready. Cool. you oh you're you're another rot cool beans we can go in mushroom hat I'm assuming. Go 
little guy is just going to eat up all these little fruit thingies. I think that gives me karma. Where'd my little dudes go though? They're all eaten up. There they go. More. Maybe it doesn't give me karma. I thought it did earlier. Move it on, move it on. Go forward. Okay, that's the way I'm supposed to go. Well, I'm gonna go this way. It's a nope. And that's a nope. At nope. Up, kiddos. here, but we can't get us more of that nasty stuff blocking the path. Can you get rid of it so we can get through? Yep. Fight more stuff. Blah blah blah. Well, that dude's got a shield. Rocky purify special flowers to restore Kina's health. And you're right onto them by pressing square. Outside of combat, Kina's health restores automatically. So I can send them to this thing. That will heal me. Once they have enough courage, that is. Oh my gosh! Okay, use rot. Okay, and that healed me up. Cool. So heavy attacks break shields, which is good. How about just a regular heavy? Yep, regular heavy does too. So no need to charge, I don't think. Ow. The flower we saw earlier is something just like that. Bring your rot together. Force tears temporarily restore the rot to the original form. Press the R control stick. Move the cloud. In this form, the rot can attack enemies, destroy barriers, and clear corruption. So I can basically control it. What am I supposed to fix, Kana? Oh, there we go. I'm running behind. Okay. I need to come back to it. Me assassins in here. Just, Just right. Spin and slam. Over here, Kina, there is something in the ground. I bet a forest here can grow here. I bet you're right. 
Oh, does that, uh... That probably bring this here. Okay, okay. So, the other area... A forest here, somewhere else, we have to find all that stuff. Good as new. Restore a flower shrine. Okay. Clear that other section there. Release. Correct. Okay. We can buy more hats. <laughs> see okay okay, okay. So this is a warp point, so I could warp back to the village if I so choose. No, I don't need to, so we're not going to. There's more poison ahead. We'll just wait here. All right, kids. I'll kill the bad guys. Hello? Oh, I can use these to attack. Okay, cool. Very neat. Closer. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, don't walk in that. Okay. That guy's blue. Rot, attack this guy. Oh no! I guess I think I pressed the wrong button. Oh, I guess I do have my shield too, huh? Oh no, I'm about dead. Oh, I'm really about dead now. But I finished it. Oh goodness.
So that'll be for that little path. And there's also that. Okay. Well, there's a rot back here. Cool. Strange that it's called rot. Okay, so there is up there and over there. Let's see if there's anything up here for. Never mind. So over here we go. In dark. And rainy. Oh, goodness. Okay. Like those seem like fragments of uh, memory or something locked there. Gonna be a boss battle here. That's what I'm thinking. I'm gonna come here, use the mask. There's Taru. That was some of his memories. Seems very sad and scary. Taro! What happened? What did you see when you put on Taro's mask? Taro is here, but he's forgotten who he is. We need to find three relics to help him remember. The forest is huge. How do we know where to look? Maybe Mr. Rusu can help us. His house is up that way. Into the woods. So they want us to go this way first. I guess that's a bit of a crossroads. Something here to kill. It's big and ugly. Probably easier just to dodge than shield at this point. All right. Getting points out other than getting some those uh, armor things doesn't. I have no idea what that's for, but I guess we'll figure that out later. Oh boy, I can buy more hat. Cause that's I wonder if that's all these little shards are for. I have no idea. I really don't care about the hats though, unless they create some kind of abilities thing. 
Nothing I can do there. All right, back to going up the, up the waterfall, heal, whatever. So I got karma from that. Actually, I can upgrade. Okay. So I could go with this. Hold R2 and square to create a rot hammer that can strike from a distance. Yeah, why not? And then while sprinting, press R1 to perform a sweeping attack. Press R1 after pairing to perform a sweep. Spinning attack. Parry would be. First of all, shield would be your parry, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's your counter attack. Okay. Okay. Ooh. So I should be able to do a counter attack there. Must be something special with those later. That's a warp. Hello, children. Lucy's house is so far away. That's because you got short legs. Check all that later. She can swim. Now can she only swim, not go under, maybe? And you swim faster. I would like you to swim faster. This is going too slow. Broke the game. Uh, today, swimmer. You must be another rot. Three more. Okay. But that's not the path. I guess it's not gonna let me climb up this. So I'm gonna guess there's not anything secret in the waterfall. Although every waterfall should have some kind of secret. So I think so. More fun that way. Okay, the the speed of her swimming is a bit annoying. Oh, there's a rod over there. Can we get to it without swimming? That would make me happy, but I don't think so. I guess the other question is, can I get to it at all? Oh, 
was so boring. Come on. So they point to having to go up in that direction. This does not appear to be the path. I just like, I can't do my spirity shieldy thing there. Climb up. Come on, climb up. Hey, lay. Cool. Way to waste my time. Can I go up this one? Okay. Don't think it's going to let me do it. Actually, I am. Yeah, I couldn't make that jump anyway. I guess we're going to go through that other path. Because that seems like that might be the way to go. I'm just not seeing something. Which is possible. Oh, you are creepy looking. Here we go. I need to practice this airy attack business. Nope. I need to double check the, uh, what is the, plus I let me go to the upscreen. I just wanted to see how you're supposed to do it. Okay, so when your shield breaks, it also hurts you. Okay. Good to know. Can't heal at the moment. No, 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 dodge that guy. Okay. Feeling better. Not anymore. Did not dodge very well. Nope. Oh, it's going to try to do the perfect parry. Didn't happen. Double check the controls for that. Wrong button again. Okay. So, oh, I could have done that too. I'll hold R2 and press square to create rot hammer. I need to practice that. Uh, press R1 after carrying a. I guess I just didn't do it, right? Well, hello there, owl thing. Yes, none of that works. Okay. Seems like there should be something there. Being that it's a glowy... 
owly thing. What if I... Oh yeah, see they got these little question marks there, don't they? I have a feeling there's just going to have to be something there that I'm going to have to figure out later. <laughs> okay. One of Tara's memories. I should see Taro. Stop. <laughs> Question will be is that going to be all a slip and slide? Okay. It is. to just this upgrade and hey okay, this one is while well, sprinting press r2 to perform a powerful overhead attack okay so i can do this now what's wrong with russo's house the trees look funny let's keep going Obviously, it's being taken over by the dead stuff. Okay. Here's like it doesn't want me to go that way, but I could be wrong. Why would that... Eh, it's just mess with you. Okay, whatever. Down here. Keep an eye on little stuff for more rots. Doesn't make me nervous at all. Yeah. 
like there is something here. Something the other way. Hopefully I'm going the right way. Or at least a way that gets me something. So if it's the wrong way, I'll have to go back. If it's the right way, I'll still have to go back because there's probably some item or something the other way. And now I'm starting to have issues with my upstream. Well, that is just frustrating. He was doing so good. There she is. Good. Hmm, the bridge is broken. Not Maybe anymore. All right. Hurry! I don't Keep think up the good work, right? That's fine. I'm going to ignore them for the moment. You can do it again here in a minute. Kill some enemies for that treasure chest. Yes. Four enemies. And so there's that ability. Oh, my life is really, really low, which is not good. Why is it so low? Oh, it's a challenge. Defeat all enemies without getting hit. Okay. Oh, I got hit. So... I'm going to have to do it again. Did it, like, game over? Because if it gamed over me, that's lame. Okay, so I'm right there. Take two. Okay, good. If the treasure chest had disappeared, I would have been sad. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Take that. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Now I just keep you busy with multiple attacks. Thank you. And I guess these are all related to um, trophies. If that's the case, it's fine because I will obviously get the platinum. Hurry! I don't think they can hold it for long. This pack is tiny. It looks like it could have belonged to one of the children. Well, that's just water. It's like, is that a little magical path that it wants me to go? That corruption is powerful. There must be their memory. I need to find another way around. go uh dinner time and whatnot um i may pop back on a little bit later afterwards um since i'm kind of interested in playing this game some more um but yeah so i'm out catch y'all later thanks for watching hey hey hey
hey friends it is time for us to go thank you again for watching and um but yeah i'm out of here so don't forget to subscribe like hit that bell whatever people like to say whatnot and uh, hang out with me later see ya